Hello all. Well, yesterday was the baby shower and I had a headache when I woke up, took something, laid back down, forgot to set my alarm and woke up at 10, 12, but got there about quarter to 12. I was supposed to be there at 11.30, not too bad. So sorry. Um, so everything went great, except for the fact that the thank yous I bought I forgot to bring because I was gonna have it, put them at everybody's place setting and have them write their name and address. Then um, also I forgot the t-shirts the onesies to have everybody decorate and I'm a little upset about that so my nieces and nephews on my side are coming over this Sunday so we'll have them decorate the 27th my siblings are so they can decorate then um, I reached out to my other nieces and nephews and when they wanted to and I'm going to give some to my son's girlfriend to, for her to give to her family so they can decorate um, them and I think that covers everybody. Oh, I'm going to do a girl. No, it doesn't cover everybody. I'm going to do a girl's night for my cousins, aunts, and um, decorate them. So, got to figure that out when because... This Saturday, can't. Sunday, can't. Uh, Saturday, I have bowling event um, with my singles group. Oh, I took my car in for service. I think I told her to use all that. And it's annoying because they didn't put my mat back right where, you know, my braking gas pedal is on my side. And I keep trying to adjust it and just not working. Um, but then next weekend is, I, I don't think I have anything next weekend. I really don't. So maybe we could do it next weekend. Mm -hmm. That would work. That really would. And then the following weekend is my siblings, so uh, that'll work. That just might work. And uh, I feel like I have something on the 28th, but oh no, I, the next weekend will not work. I have a wedding. Oh my god, oh man. I just can't. Um. Uh, no. said the 27th so it might have to be May 4th no yeah May 4th that Saturday would be I don't think we have anything May 4th but I don't know sounds familiar don't know Oh, excuse me. Yeah. So, oh my goodness. Uh, bit, a little bit busy day at work today because my bosses were back. Um, ow, my face is itchy on this side only. Uh, went to dinner with my son and granddaughter. And actually, next door was a five below. 
and she's always like, you got crayons, you got a mark, you got a marker, you got a pencil, you got a pen. So I got this sketchbook and it's eight and a half by 11 or eight by 10, I'm not sure. I think it's eight and a half by 11. And it's like a spiral. So she can pull it out if she wants or she can keep it in there. And a pack of, gosh, it's probably at least 50 colored pencils. She loved them. And I said, you can leave it in daddy's car. So this way, when you go somewhere, you can, because there's usually papers all over. Like either the place gives her paper, my son has paper with the crayons and the crayons are all over. But they came in a nice case. So I figured this is nice for future. And that's what I said to her. Whenever you go anywhere, here you go. Oh my God. Um, just went through a yellow light. Well, the guy behind me went through it too. So. Um, so yeah, so I thought that was nice. Um, to get it. and it only cost the book must have been I know the pencils were five dollars but I want to say it was nine dollars and something so the book must have been four dollars so so that was nice so now she'll have that and she actually draws pretty well I have to say and, um, oh my God, I am so full. I am so tired. I am so full. Although, shockingly, I'm thinking, oh, Chinese, I might have a headache. But, um, I don't. Actually, my headache that I've had all day is kind of, it's still slightly there, but not there as much as it's been all day. And I did take to Walgreens migraine, um, you know, the equivalent to Excedrin migraine. And I used to take Excedrin migraine. And one time, I don't know, it was on a recall or something, or something. And um, I asked the pharmacist, and I was in Walgreens. He said, try our brands, you know, the same ingredients. So I bought a small thing of it. I think it was only like 20 or 25 pills. And um, it worked great. So I've been using that ever since because it's a lot cheaper. And I got 200 Walgreens migraine pills. What is this guy's problem? Like, you've got to be effing kidding me. Yeah, screw you. Dude, he's like scratching his nose like this. Because he was like swerving back and forth and back and forth. Because we're only doing 44 and the speed limit back there until we just hit 50 now was 45. Like I can't go faster than the people in front of me. But he was like going this and this. Going like this and this and this and this and this. Behind me. And um, there was traffic coming the other way. And there's solid lines so you shouldn't pass but... Um, someone passed me on, it was on the phone with you, I mean, recording then, I don't know if I was yet or not, but came and passed me on the left, went, and, which is what you're supposed to do, but not in, when it's two lanes and it's solid in the middle, but whatever. Because, again, I was doing, I think, 37 in a 40. Whatever. But, um, it's so nice to see so many people out and about. It is 63 degrees at 712. So, let's see if my dog will go out. Yesterday, would not go out. I don't know what her issue was. It was beautiful out yesterday nothing with the weather and she just would not go out so she did tear up some more tissues so I don't know what the deal is there but whatever doggy so hopefully she'll go right away out for me and um, 
Oh my God. Oh, I have these lights that look like lantern. They're square. Dollar store, if anybody's been to the dollar store. They're solar lights. And I thought I could attach them to my railing. But it eh, cannot. So I'm a little upset about that. And I got zip ties from the dollar store that I thought would fit around my railing. But they're not the skinny ones they will, but I don't have the lights around there. So the other my white lights. And I would oh no. I would put them the rail like the skinny part of the railing, but it's the skinny part and then you know the square part is, is wider. So that doesn't exactly work. So what are you gonna do? I would put them behind the bushes here, like on their part, but I'm afraid they'll get pissed off because that's their property. But I don't know. Sorry. Oh, my nose. I think my headache's going away because my nose is draining. So that might be part of it. My hair is parted in the middle today. Um, I might try that. I don't know. Somebody complimented me today. So, um, hope everybody got to see the solar eclipse. I had my glasses, which my granddaughter was like, wow, those are like regular glasses. I ordered them off of Amazon. Hoping they'd come Saturday so I could give them to my children yesterday. But, didn't happen. They came last night. So, but these, I won't be able to see you. But this is, uh, I can, it's so weird. You can't see a thing. They're like totally black. But that's what they said. If you look into the glasses... And uh, I'll save them. If you look in the glasses and you can't see anything, then those are the real deal. Because I guess there were some fakes out there. I don't know who would sell fakes. But, um, yeah, so they're the real deal. And, well, it worked out because my boss had a pair then. Well, both my bosses. Um, one of the guys in work, oh, two of the guys in work, and then one of the girls I used to work with, she put it on Facebook. Does anybody have a pair? So, um, yep. So, there you go. So, my kids couldn't use them, but people could. And the girl I used to work with, she's like, how much? I'm like, Seriously, they weren't that much, no. So, but, yep, 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 yep. So, it was neat. And I'll put these away because in, I think it's August 3rd of 2044. I know it's 2044. I'm not sure of the exact date. That's the next time. A solar eclipse. So. Now I tell my boss. I'm like. Oh. Whose son's four. I was like. Um. Your son will be. 24. And your daughter will be 28. Going to be 29. The same. Well. Not. His son isn't. My daughter's 25. Going to be 26. So. I said. The same age my children are now. It's like. Stop. That's crazy. I was like, yes, it is. So I'm going to check my mailbox tonight because everybody seems to have gotten to save the dates. Well, no, my sister said the only one in her house that got to save the date was her son. And my son got it. And 
the go consensus around the table yesterday was no one else got it. So maybe they sent to, you know, their cousins first. Don't you know? But oh my goodness. So all right, I'm gonna go in and this was a short one. But just want to let you know the shower went great. I received a, so much thank you from her mother. She went around and she was like, oh, if it wasn't for Terry, she was a godsend, you know. And I just was worried that, like, I was stepping on her toes. And she's like, no, no, no. And uh, it was nice because I was very included um, in the shower. Uh, and... Uh, and then, um, she sent me a thank you. Um, my daughter-in-law sent me, uh, me and her mom in the same thing. Thank you for everything you did. Um, my son thanked me overnight. He goes, you did way too much. You bought too much. Um, and, um. You know, I did thank her mother. I was like, thank you for including me, you know, so much in every step of the aspect of it. I wasn't, in, you know, so so much included in the first one. And, um, you know, I was told, okay, this is how much you owe. So, so that was that. But, um, yeah, so it was very nice. She got so much stuff. My son is like his dining room, his living room, <laughs> I think the playroom is filled with stuff. They haven't even opened all the stuff. They don't even know, and they're just overwhelmed, I think. So, yeah, so that's a little bit of, you know, so. And then this Thursday, I get my granddaughter all to myself for dinner. They're going away on a baby moon. Um, it's like, you know, like a honeymoon, except, you know, called the baby moon before you have the baby. So, um, I don't know who these people are. I've never seen these people before coming out of my building. Oh my goodness. Oh, my hair is, so, yeah, I think I'm going to part it in the middle for a little bit and I don't know that it's totally in the middle, but I think I'm going to do that. I seriously have never seen these two kids before. Maybe they were playing with someone in the building and they're leaving. I don't know. One looks kind of like a teenager, like high school, if, if not older. And then the other girl looks like she's maybe like 12, maybe 13. I don't know. She's got kind of a little bit of a baby face. So. And he's on her scooter, it seems. Because she's trying to get him off. That is not working. But. Alright. So, everything was a success yesterday. Except I forgot the thank yous. Forgot the Amazon gift cards. Forgot the onesies. But we're going to take care of that. So. I'm just so, 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 so freaking, oh, so, but, yes, but, mad at myself, all in the box, in the spare bedroom, and I had everything out until my nieces and nephews and their kids came the day before Thanksgiving. Um, Thanksgiving. Easter, and then I was like, oh, these have to go away, you know, and I put them in the, and I guess I, I should have put everything in my car the night before, but I didn't. That's what I should have did, but I did not, so my own fault, and I feel bad because my son and daughter-in-law ordered invitations um invitation thank yous 
So I was like, all right, you can have these because they're blue. And um, I told my son I got thank yous. So I don't, he forgets stuff. And um, I said, you can use them when people give you stuff for the baby. So what am I going to tell you? I think actually there's only 40 thank yous. I'm not sure. I think there might be 40. Only 40. So, because I was thinking like two, you know, if you live at the same house, something like that. I don't know. But whatever. All right. Um, hope everybody had a good Monday. Enjoyed the solar eclipse. Hope no one looked directly at the sun. I hope you were able to have glasses and look at it. It was pretty neat. Or share them with somebody. And um, I hope this nice weather continues. Hey, listen. 63, 65, 70. I could deal with that all year round. If it was between 60 and even 50 and like 75 all year round. If there was a place I could live, that's where I'd live. And on the man front nothing there's been guys that write to me on the POF that's the only one I'm on I don't even go on but there was guys writing and they're scammers I'm so happy with I don't get on here often please provide your email address well, no isn't happening sorry my nose is itchy. but yeah so, but yuppers. So, enjoy your night. I'm gonna go in, walk my dog, feed her, wait a little while, walk her again, and then hopefully that's it for the night. And I go to bed early, I'm tired. I don't know. I'm having a hard time keeping my eyes open in the last night, too. So, I dozed off early. Woke up. Dozed back. You know, was up for a little while, but dozed back. I don't know. Then, finally, I think for the night, it was like after 12. I was like solid after that. But, yeah. Alright. Talk to you later. Bye.